Hi, y'all. Choice here. Thank you so very much for joining me again for another session of Choice Spirit. I just, I go, I may go off topic. I may go off topic. But I'm thinking I want to speak about thinking and feeling. I spoke I speak a lot about, you know, your thoughts creating your reality and all of that. But I haven't tapped on the importance of feelings. You see, your thoughts, your words, and even your actions, your deeds, with the power of your emotion, which is your feelings, that become emotions, right? Propelling whatever that word, thought, deed is with full force, it's going to do something. The impact is going to go okay that's how powerful our emotions are a word out very powerful we know that I tell you every word you speak it's it's like a prayer you you're putting out something with your DNA in it, your breath, your attention, your everything is in that word, and what you believe the definition of that word when it leaves your mouth. When it comes out of your mouth, your mind, out of the invisible, into the physical, when it leaves your mouth, the word, it begins to ripple through, it makes things happen within the physical once it leaves the invisible and comes through your mouth into the physical. Thought the same way. Thought comes through your mind. To express that thought then becomes word out of your mouth. Now any of those things with the power of your feelings, your emotions, is what really makes things happen. Now let's go back a little bit. The thought from the imagination, the idea. The idea is, is a part of you already. The idea already exists, but you are vibrating at a certain t place where now you're connecting to ideas that you may not have been able to connect to when you were vibrating at a different level of vibration. See, as you vibrate at different levels, there's certain thoughts and ideas that you can attract at that level in which you are vibrationally. Okay? So that's why I always speak about vibing high. I always speak about vibing high because I, I really and truly want us to be able to uh, uh, call forth and connect with those that are, those things that are more uh, of well-being, of health and wellness, of peace and prosperity, of love and compassion, of joy and happiness and fun and laughter. So I speak about high vibes. Those who want and are ready and have a desire or, you know, to, to experience a more fulfilling and, you know, life or whatever. It's not to say that your life is not already filled with wonderful things and you're excited about life and loving life. It's, it's not to say that. There's always more and more and more and more and more to life that we have yet to discover. There's so much that we have yet to even experience. But a lot of times we can't know or don't know what we don't know that we don't know 
that we don't know that we don't know. Right? So we basically hang around the areas that are familiar with what we know. We don't go too far from that. So my, my talking about vibing higher is will show up in the lives, I guess, in some way or form by me or, or many others that are out here that are speaking uh, this, who really, truly want to share how we can do better or do more, experience more with our lives, right? So back on topic, here I go off. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I go off. But back on topic, our feelings, our emotions, our Thought and idea comes from the ether and also is a part of us. It's within us also. So the ideas come from that. The ideas come from that. And when you are ready, it's like, you know, being prepared for the idea. And when the idea comes through, then you can act on it. That's acting through inspiration. You can express it. You can write it down. When it comes, write it down. And then you move on those ideas when it's in alignment with what you're desiring for your, you know, for your life. Then you move on it because that's the most high speaking and showing you and guiding you the, uh, through realms. <laughs> <laughs> you know, guiding and showing and directing, you know, when you feel that. So anyway, quickly, I know I may have went off a little bit, but anyway, when you're, when the word comes through, the idea, the inspired idea, the thought comes through from the invisible into the visible, when it, it comes out of your mouth with your feelings and your emotions, which then begins to create the the physical from the invisible. Because once it's in your mind, once the idea comes, it's already there, it, it exists, everything exists. But once you vibe up into that place where you can conceive it, and then you allow it to come through your filters and out of your mouth, then you can experience it. Hey, much love. We'll go more into this later. Namaste. Peace.